Let's read God's word together. It comes from 1 Kings chapter 5, verse 4 and 5. 1 Kings chapter 5, verse 4 and 5. Let's read God's word together. 1, 2, 3. But now the Lord my God has given me rest on every side, and there is no adversary or disaster. I intend, therefore, to build a temple for the name of the Lord my God, as the Lord told my father David when he said, Your son, whom I will put on the throne in your place, will build a temple for my name. Amen. Let's pray. Oh Lord, we thank you for allowing us uh, to come to church today so that we could uh, learn about you and your word. Uh, we pray that you will help us to listen with faith, with open hearts, open ears, open minds, so that we can understand, accept, believe, and follow uh, what your word has to tell us today. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let me ask you a couple questions to start. Okay. Uh, we all went back to our schools recently, in the last couple weeks. Why do you go to school? Okay. Why do you go to school? I think uh, the main reason is to learn, to learn, okay? to learn. We go to school to learn from teachers and different things. Okay? Let me give another question. Why do you go home every day? Okay? Why do you go home? After school, after church, after playing, you go home, right? Why do you go home? It's an obvious question, but why? Okay? To rest to um, to sleep, to spend time with family. Um, there's, all, there's a lot of good reasons why we go home every day, right? Another question, why do we go to the beach? Okay, why have you, got, have you gone to the beach? Why do you go to the beach? To swim, to play with the sand, to walk around, to enjoy um, God's creation and to see those things, right? Okay, that's why we go to the beach. Now I'll ask you the final question. Why do we go to church? Okay. Why do we go to church? Why do we meet together like this? Going to school, going home, going to the beach. Very obvious reasons why we go, right? But how about church? Why do we go to church? In our story today, Solomon built the temple of God, which is in essence, God's church, our church, right? The church that we go to. And there are many great reasons why we go to church. And we'll share three today. Okay, the first one is to honor God. Everyone say, to honor God. To honor God. Do you know who uh, this is? Um, uh, whose monument this is? This is, right? Do you guys know? Abraham Lincoln. The Lincoln Memorial. Why did, and obviously Abraham Lincoln was a great president long, long time ago, and he's not alive anymore. Why did we make this uh, monument to remember Abraham Lincoln for all the great things he's done, right? To think about him, to remember him for however many years it, it will stay there. And the same thing, when we go to church, it's to honor God, to remember all the great things He's done for us, how much He loves us, right? how much He cares for us, how much He um, loves us so much that He sent His Son to die. We come to church similarly to how we honor the people who have gone before us, to honor God, to show uh, to, see, to show how much love we have for Him. The second reason we go to church is to be with God. Everyone say, to be with God. To be with God. What is your favorite activity to do with family or friends? One of them is, for me, camping. Okay, I think it's fun with the campfire, and you cook outside, and, and you, you sit outside, and you see the stars, and, and, and you're out in nature, right? It's nice. Okay. But imagine you went camping with your enemy. Okay. Imagine you went camping with someone that hates you. Imagine you went camping with right, 
someone who wants to even hurt you. Would that be a great time of camping? As great as camping is, as fun as camping is, who you're camping with is most important, is it not? It's the same thing. We come to church not to just, you know, eat snacks and not to just play with friends, not to just, you know, jump up and down and have fun. We come to be with God. Because without God, all of this is meaningless. We're here to be with God, to enjoy God, to have that great time with God, uh, intimate time. We're spending time with God together as a family. So the second reason is to be with God. The third one and last one we're going to share is we come to church to share about God. Can everyone say, to share about God. Right? The church is not um, like, a, like a, a cool people group where you know, it, it, it stops at about 10 people or 15 or 100 people. It just stops. Right? The church's goal is to bring people who don't know Jesus into our family, into God's family. Right? And we see here that a brother is sharing Jesus to his friend. Why? Because Jesus is that great. Right? Jesus is that awesome. Jesus is the one who saved his life and heart and, and rescued him from sin. And so he wants to share Jesus to his friend. And it's the same thing. This church, this body of Christ, we come to church so that we can share about Jesus to the world. So, brothers and sisters, when you come to church, always remember, I'm here to honor God, to remember all the great things He's done for me. I'm here to be with God, to have a close relationship and time with God, a special time with God. I'm here so that I can learn how to help others learn about the hope of Jesus, the love of Jesus, how Jesus sets us free from sin and gives us true happiness. I'm here so that I can know how to bring people to this place so we can worship together. Always remember those things as we come so that we can have an even greater time worshiping together um, at church. Amen? Amen. Let's pray. Lord, there is no question. Uh, we know why we go to school, why we go home, why we go to the beach. But sometimes we don't understand and know fully why we go to church. Is it because our parents? Is it because we've always gone to church? Is it because it's something we just do on Sundays? No, Lord, it's deeper than that. It's more important than that. We come to church for many great reasons. And the three we learned today is number one, to honor you to remember all the great things you've done for us, for sending your son Jesus, for loving us, for guiding us, for giving us strength and wisdom and love. We also come, Lord, because we want to spend time with you. No matter how great anything may be, it's who you spend that time with. And that's why we come, to spend time with God our Savior. And lastly, we come because we want to share about Jesus. And a lot of times we don't know how to. And so we learn how. And we bring them to church and we share about how Jesus has saved me. And so help us to remember these things. That we don't come for small reasons or unimportant reasons. We come because of these great reasons. Because of Jesus. Help us to remember. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.